Hello guys, what's going on? This is my second day with Rival Kingdoms and today we'll be mostly raiding, raiding and raiding because we need to get these trophies that are really called honor but they look like trophies so it's easier for me to call them like that or whatever I will just learn in time also keep in, keep in mind that I'm still a big newbie uh, and my newbie skills at this game are extremely lame at the low level so I don't know how the raiding mechanics work at all and I'll be still figuring out all of the stuff this is one of the best win streaks at the moment oh, not the best, not my record but it was going very well till now I've attacked from the wrong side I was supposed to attack from the stronghold side to make it much easier but still a good honor this trick, 56 honor and the reward I only lost 12 honor so that was not bad but let's start from over again yeah now facing Bark Ward 82 of course the beginning is very easy and let's see how far we can get this is just my second day in that game and I think that I'm doing very well so this is my the only ancient that I have the only hero and hopefully I will get more of them soon I need more ancients and uh, yeah so first as a bait we'll be spawning soldiers and then uh, our crossbowmen to destroy the tower so it's pretty smart strategy and that's how it works at the, start, at the beginning now we are getting just a bunch of mana from destroying stronghold and we are spawning our demon that helps help us a lot and uh, some meteor rains and this is how the first raid looks like nothing hard to be honest but we don't get really good rewards for that the farther we get in raiding the better rewards we get of course so this is really important to do not fail at the beginning and try as much as possible to get far far in win streak okay so this is a this is just a crossbow tower I mean watchtower yeah I think it's called watchtower and this side so just spawning our troops from that side and make it really easy and of course we can speed up the raid because why just looking at it for one or two minutes this is extremely cool thing in this game that you can speed up the raid and don't waste your time just staring at the monitor okay 15 diamonds I like that <laughs> I will not regret taking diamonds from the chest sideman 94 okay so let's see what he has right there in his village he has as always just one tower one watchtower and it will be pretty easy again so let's destroy the gold storage and then they will take care of the watchtower exactly and now now it's over he has no defense buildings from now and let's just destroy the stronghold spawn the demon and speed up everything okay this is what I'm talking about now we can just speed up and look how everything gets destroyed in seconds oh come on just show, show me the rewards not sure if this is my internet lags a little bit or just the game has delays but it doesn't matter the most important thing is that the game works well okay so let's use some free stones battle stones to continue our win streak of course you can just wait till they recover till you recover your battle stones and continue the win streak but we don't want to wait of course we don't want to wait we want to burn villages we want to destroy smash everything victory is coming for us okay so what we've got here not a very strong village just 
again watchtower at this side so let's just re destroy it from the start from the beginning and then take care of everything else okay stronghold is under attack and it, now it burns it blows up and we are spawning our demon uh, no no other spells available for now we need more mana but whatever we can just speed up I'm I'm really curious why they're attacking the the builder wooden house if I have already won the battle that's pretty weird okay so there's a relic chest let's open it maybe we'll get something decent oh this is a new ancient Kestra my second ancient mm, just a common but I have no clue if she is a good one or bad common are should be pretty bad but who knows I don't know this game very well so maybe let's check how she works I haven't seen all the ancients yet so now I might take a look at them okay so let's take a look at her exactly what she does <laughs> okay I think that we can try her but maybe later maybe later now let's continue fighting with Zai Zai's mom <laughs> what a weird nickname yeah again easy raid no problems but notice please notice that if I lose such a raid I can lose 28 trophies that is crazy such punishment for losing okay maybe an easy raid but if someone is a newbie <laughs> it's very it's most likely possible for him to lose this raid okay oh so I've got these new spells from my new ancient I I didn't meant to to activate it activate it huh. oh my troops got some really nice boost it looks like Aerys Frenzy from Castle Clash it boosts their speed and movement speed and attack speed I think so and it's it's really crazy spell I like it okay win streak 5 so how far can we get how far rewards 200 gold some only one honor that's not good we need more honor <sighs> then 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 we're facing Lutol over 500 gold that's good and we can win 8 honor so here's some buildings under construction so so it won't be hard but that watchtower has a high level and there's a catapult and magic tower hmm that won't be an easy raid but we can give it a try okay so so what that spell makes what it does manipulate tower hmm do you want to use it or just wait for the Aries frenzy the last and the most expensive spell okay it seems not to be working or am I doing something bad not good I don't know let's let's just put a rain again let's try again mm, okay that seems to be the worst spell in this game it does almost zero damage oh my god I shouldn't have used it okay but whatever we have won the battle and have another chest to open so let's see what's inside 400 gold I will take it why not and we are getting stronger and stronger we are progressing in this game okay so this is our lovely village no we don't want to leave it why would we okay oh they asked us to rate it so I think that for now we can give this game five stars 
and see how it will look later when we progress and will be in the further game more game modes available more stuff guilds and stuff like that oh 10 diamonds that's pretty cool I like taking diamonds from quests it's really enjoyable thing okay honor gain honor by beating other players yeah that's why you know battle stones shield invisible prepared un unwavering no sure what it means no idea how to get the last one for now I think that I have an invisible shield and when it drops I will be unprepared or the second one okay so this is the best player top 6 and I'm at the very bottom at the very bottom of the list of players oh my god so this is the top one player and his base just looks crazy oh my god so many high level buildings so strong defenses high level holes oh how is it possible to destroy such a base i have no idea but i will know i will beat that guy in the future i will do it don't worry so we have another quest and we claimed the gold we have almost full storages and what we can do there oh this is ancient shrine i have problems with who is spelling that word with with saying it ancient it's a pretty weird word okay uh, level two do we want to upgrade it no 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 so let's take a look what we can do here we can upgrade that ancient and make her spells more powerful do we want to do this? do we really want it? I'm not sure okay okay no better no let's save these crystals for something better and stronger what is this? Empowers troops with Kestra ag agility, improves movement and attack for 50%. Wow, that's very strong. That's like Aries Frenzy level 5 in Castle Clash. But what about Sulric, our first ancient? Summons one greater fire elemental level 2, ignoring deploy, uh, deploy area. Okay. Oh, this only one works on the spell towers, on the magic towers, so I was doing so big mistakes in my first video. I was using it against watch towers and it was not protecting them. Rain of fire hmm. and flame bolt, what, what is it? I don't know what is it and where can I use it, but I will find out in the future. No worries guys. Okay, so for now, maybe let's upgrade our troop portal to gain more troops and it will help us, it will greatly influence on our raiding results and we can skip for free upgrading gold smelter, troop portal, yeah, let's upgrade it too. And in 22 minutes, 23 actually, We'll have more troops available and trading will be much easier for us. Oh yeah. Okay. So let's take a look at her again. And uh, do we really want to upgrade her? No. Better no. Or maybe, maybe. Okay, let's upgrade her. Why not? Uh, it has some cool animations and fusion complete ancient castro upgraded to level 3. Confuse and Volley are at higher level and there's no big difference. I wanted to have Aries Frenzy, the, the most expensive spell upgraded at higher level. Oh my god, it was not worth it. I wanted that spell to be upgraded but it wasn't. 
Okay, anyway, I will be doing many mistakes at the beginning of the game, so please don't be mad at me. Just write in comments all my mistakes. You can point them, point them out, so I won't do them again. Uh, I won't make same mistakes over and over if you tell me what kind of mistakes I am making. Okay, so let's spawn our troops near to the uh, near to the catapult, so it will be blind. These troops are not in the near range of the catapult because near to the catapult it's it's almost blind. It cannot attack them. It needs to be further. It needs it needs to be longer range. Okay. Let's see the difference now. Oh my god. That stupid train is not even strong. I I shouldn't upgrade that ancient green ancient that is common. Oh my god. I lost honor from that streak. Are you are you kidding me? Okay, anyway, we have to move and Let's see, let's see. Maybe this time it will be much better. Smartly in 70. I think these all nicknames are just gener generated randomly and players don't know how to change them. This is what I think and it is probably the truth because all of them have numbers at the end. So, okay, let's speed up the beginning. This is very easy. Let's put a f f that spell and yeah the difference is really big 50% but the problem is that it costs a lot of mana magic points not sure how they call it in this game okay let's use more battle stones and let's continue the raiding 5 2 31 again generated randomly nickname Maybe one day they will know how to change their nickname. Okay, again, watchtower at the side, and we are just hitting all our troops, speeding up, and watching, watching the raiding, putting a spell to make them move faster, and well, the duration of the spell is not that long, but the spell is really powerful. Let's don't hide it. Threshold chest. Let's get something really cool from it. I want something cool. 400 gold? Okay, I will take that. We have already two, two packs of the 400 gold in our store. On, in our inventory, I mean. And we have used them. Okay. So, oh, this is some Russian nicknames. Stary. Uh, Starizal Starizal, no idea what it means. 59, but I'm not sure. it's probably not a generated randomly nickname. Or maybe it is, who knows. Anyway, cheers for everyone who's watching my videos in Russia or maybe speaks Russian. So cheers to all my Russian fans. I know Russian too. Da, ja umiem gawrić na ruskim jazykie. Nie, nie очень хорошо. No, ja pani maju, co wy piszecie na ruskim jazykie. <laughs> yeah. So let's don't make it Russian video. Just, just a small, small sample of my Russian language. My Russian is not really not really perfect, but still, still, I can speak it. And okay, let's focus on the game. But there is nothing much to do. You can see, this is all the same at the time, at the beginning. Then it gets harder because in further game, players are managing their bases and they are making them stronger and stronger. But these bases are just random. Another relic chest. Can you get a dragon? I want to have a dragon. 
I've seen some players with a Draco. Mauler, okay. They might be helpful in raids. Hmm, hmm. Okay, Pels Kling uh, 42. He has two watchtowers, but still it won't be a big problem. Let's take them down. Spawning our troops from both sides. Targeting watchtowers at the beginning. And then moving farther, of course. Now it's all about cleaning the base, so let's speed up everything and let's claim the reward. Okay. It takes me, on average, less than 50 normal seconds to raid a base, but when I speed it up, it takes maybe 15 seconds. I think so. So it's much better than in Castle Clash. Because in Castle Clash you cannot speed up anything, absolutely anything, and that is dumb. There is a Jarrett 4824, that's not a random nickname I think, because there are four numbers and Jarrett is, num is a name. Okay, he has three towers. Okay, let's put our heroes, I mean troops near to the magic tower. Oh my god, they are targeting the gold vault. No, no, don't lose it, don't lose it. Uh, let's use the Confess spell. All good. Now, the tower is attacking Town Hall. I mean Stronghold, sorry. And the spell is not very strong. Oh my god. The spell has a short time. And again, we lost a lot of trophies. A lot of honor in that streak. Ah, what a new BMI, what a new BMI, why, for what scenes, tell me, oh my god. So, this is what we've got for today, raiding, raiding and raiding, we've used a lot of battle stones, we've lost a lot of honor, because I was making stupid mistakes, I was losing battles that I shouldn't lose because they were really easy to win ah, sorry excuse me guys maybe future videos will be much more professional with much more professional raiding with much more experienced player but for now let's let's use gems to skip these buildings because i want to try out these these new troops additional troops and let's use some gold to upgrade our walls and upgrade troop portals again so thanks around for watching, if you enjoyed watching this video, make sure guys make sure guys to like it, write comments and stay tuned for more in future. It will be probably shorter videos because these are pretty damn long. So enjoy and see ya later. Bye!